Imagine a tidal wave of mud so fast and fierce you can see how high the levels were up to the side of this lodge. Now, ever since New Year's Eve, volunteers have been working tirelessly to the bone, digging themselves out, trying to salvage what they can, and they still need so much help from the community tonight. I've never experienced anything like this, the power and the force and how quickly, you know, things could be normal and all of a sudden, complete tragedy. Set among the majestic redwoods of Pescadero, Venture Retreat Center is a nonprofit for those in search of a slice of peace in an otherwise chaotic world. It's been here since 1965. There's been so many wonderful healing groups here. But never did Janelle Bartlett, who volunteers her time running the center, imagine the chaos that unfolded New Year's Eve. It looked like somebody opened a dam coming out of the went coming out of the house. In what felt like an instant, the storm's wrath mixed with mud penetrated their main lodge and surrounding grounds, displacing a visiting group. Overwhelming. So much, so much work to be done and, and shovel by shovel, step by step. Armed with whatever tools they can find, volunteers have been painstakingly digging out, salvaging whatever is left, which isn't much. And like the nearly two weeks of relentless rain, the task at hand feels never ending. We need lots of hands, lots of bodies, and finances. You know, we, we, I don't think we'll survive without, without help from somewhere. Janelle is doubtful insurance will cover much, if anything. And with the impending rain in the forecast, can't wait. Please help us. The retreat center has since started a GoFundMe to help with the cleanup. They make this plea to the public watching tonight. In Pescadero, Dion Lim, ABC7 News.